Today is the third Saturday of Advent. We light the third candle, the pink one, for joy. The readings are rich, and for me there are three important things to take away. First, we have two joyful announcements from angels foretelling the birth of one of God's powerful warriors, and then the birth of a simple, humble man. Secondly, we hear what happens when one does not trust in the Lord. And finally, discerning what my own special role and mission is. In the first reading, we hear the story of Manoah. Manoah's wife was barren and had borne no children. An angel of the Lord appeared to her and said, You will conceive and bear a son, for the boy is to be consecrated to God from the womb until the day of his death. The woman bore a son and named him Samson. Samson grew up and the Lord blessed him. He defended the temple and was a great warrior. The scripture says, The Spirit of the Lord stirred him. In the Gospel, we hear about Zechariah, the father of John the Baptist. The angel of the Lord appeared to him, and he was troubled by what he saw. Fear came upon him. But the angel said to him, Do not be afraid, Zechariah, because your prayer has been heard. Your wife Elizabeth will bear you a son, and you shall name him John. You will have joy and gladness, and many will rejoice at his birth, for he will be great in the sight of the Lord. Like Samson, John the Baptist had an important mission and role to play in this life. As prophesied by the angel of the Lord, John was filled with the Holy Spirit and turned many of the children of Israel to the Lord their God. He prepared the way for Jesus. He lived his life for the Lord. The parents of Samson, as well as the parents of John the Baptist, were surprised by God's answer to their prayer. Would your response to the miracle of an unexpected child be similar to Zacharias? Would you be puzzled, doubtful, and afraid? Zacharias said to the angel, How shall I know this? He did not understand how this could be. Because of his disbelief, he was left speechless and unable to talk until the day that these things took place. Mary, the mother of Jesus, responded to the miracle of an unexpected child by saying yes when the angel Gabriel came to her. So as you read the scriptures today, ask yourself, how am I responding to God's call? Do I say yes to the Lord? Or do I hesitate, question, doubt? God gives each of us a place and a role to fulfill as we move through our lives. Here at St. Paul Catholic Church, we have a unique opportunity to participate in the upcoming Christ Life program that will help us examine our role in life, look at our life's purpose, grow in relationship with the Lord, and develop a deeper prayer life. Let us go joyfully this third Saturday of Advent and celebrate the lives of Samson and John the Baptist. Celebrate the gift of your life and mission, and with a spirit of gratitude, let us anticipate the birth of Jesus. Come, Lord Jesus, Prince of Peace.